What's up, you guys? My name is Mary I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. Um, this is a free general collective reading. This is for Caps, Who Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Um, the channel, I um, received a channeling. That's why I'm putting this video out. I heard someone is secretly competing with you. That's what I heard. So someone is secretly competing with you. There's a little more to it. They're secretly competing with you. I heard some weight loss, some, um, uh, some weight loss, some secret tarot card reading, um, channels. And, uh, what was the other one? Um, there was another one and I forgot it. There was another one. If I remember it, I'll let you know. Um, so some weight loss. So they're secretly competing with you for with weight loss. They're trying to see if they can look better than you. I'm presuming. Uh, why? Why would you secretly want to compete with anybody with weight loss? I, I, I always put that very public. But um, I guess somebody secretly wants to compete with you um, with weight loss. And some um, secret tarot card reading channels, why you would want to make that secret too, I have no idea. But, you know, that's for somebody in the universe. And um, there was another one, but I, I forgot it. Um, you, you plug it in, how it resonates. Blessings on the bottom of the deck. It's not going to work for them the way they think it's going to work. Not enough dedication or creativity. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. But it's not go going to work for them the way they think it's going to work. Not enough dedication and creativity. So blessings on the bottom of the deck, I think for you, because... Um, if this is for you, because, but the thing is, is why is somebody secretly competing with you? Why don't they just be out open and in, in the public with it? Um, I don't get that. So I guess that's their negative karma that it's not going to work well for them because why don't they just put it out in the public? That doesn't make any sense. Secretly competing with you. Um, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I guess that's why. But it sounds like blessings are going to come to you because whoever you are, it doesn't seem like you are, are trying to hide. It don't seem like you're trying to hide about things. It seems like you're very open and uh, with yourself and about things. And this person or people are not. I heard it's not going to work for them the way they think it's uh, going to work for them. Uh, no dedication or creativity. So they have no creativity and no dedication towards the situation, whether it's weight loss or... Um, Secret tarot card reading channels. How that resonates. We have blessings top two. Uh, you know, everybody's different. I don't judge anybody. I don't judge anybody. But that that to me doesn't make any sense. But it is what it is. Spirit messages you have for Pippin. Yeah. Cave Sanctuary secretly doing this. And it was upright. They're secretly doing tarot card reading channels. They're secretly trying to lose weight. Why don't you publicly try to lose weight and publicly do your tarot card reading channel or tarot card reading business? However, I mean, how are the resonates? They're secretly doing it. They're hiding in their cave. Privacy, uh, secret, secret, secret squirrel energy. And someone is going to communicate with you. inquiring about a cam girl service you're going to turn it around on them and blast them all over social media as you should <laughs> wow ah! you plug it in how it resonates wow somebody's about to get somebody well you know let me tell you that's exactly what i would do and i've done it before i have um, somebody um, messages me inappropriately, I turn around, I screenshot it, and I post it all over my Facebook. I've done it many, many, many times, many times, and it shuts them right up. And that's just the truth. 
Um, if you're going to play nasty and dirty and raunchy with me, I play it right back with you. And I blast you all over social media. Um, I don't go in or nasty and raunchy to anybody else. So I don't expect the same behavior back to me. You know what I'm saying? So whoever this is, you play that, you play that too. I feel you keep to yourself. You are very, um, you don't go around, probably, you probably don't go around inquiring about Cam's, whoever you are, your femme energy, if that resonates for you, your femme energy, for sure. Somebody wants to see your body. They want to see your body. They're going to inquire about Cam Girl services. But I heard you're going to turn it around on them and blast them all over social media and embarrass them, basically. Um, so, sanctuary. Um, <laughs> um, them hiding in their little safe space when they um, inquire about Cam Girl services. Y you do not put yourself out like this. It's about to turn around on them in a huge way. Okay, I heard you do not put yourself out like this. It's about to turn around on them in a huge way. So you go with your bad self. So they're going to be scared hiding in their sanctuary. This is scared energy for them once you embarrass the hell out of them and blast it all over social media. Um, whether it's Facebook, Insta, um, uh, Twitter, uh, Parlay, what have you. You're going to, I don't know if you're going to screenshot it and put it on social media like I did in the past. Uh, sounds That kind of sounds like the same type of energy it might be a little different ever you know your creativity might be different but um you plug it in how it resonates i don't blame you i don't i don't blame you like i said i've done it before i've done it before it was this raunchy nasty little um person that i that annoyed used to annoy the hell out of me on the bus um i remember this dude and then he asked me for um talking dirty to me asking me for blah 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 and i was like i was like who do you think you're talking to so i screenshotted everything and put it, blasted it all over facebook and he got so mad breach yeah you can't make this crap up breach you are about to breach it on social media whoever is about to inquire about sam cam girl services for to you and i don't blame you breach it out And there's about to be a huge explosion on social media. Huge. So much information is about to come forward very publicly. To many, 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 many people. Many. It's about to benefit a lot of people. Information they didn't know. Some people are going to be mortified. Because they're thieves. Someone from the news station will probably get a hold of this information. Oh my God. So you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. Holy crap. So, okay. There's about to be a social media frenzy, apparently. You could be part of the social media frenzy or you could be the one um, seeing the social media frenzy. Um, however, that resonates for you. A lot of social media energy on here. Um, I heard there's about to be an explosion of information on social media, basically. An explosion of information on social media. And basically, um, uh, it's, I heard it's going to benefit a ton of people. Because some people didn't know person, people, place, family, or situation was stole from. So it's going to benefit, I'm assuming, the people that know that somebody or some people or family or what have you was, wasn't, was stole from. They're about to find out. I heard one person from a, new, the new, a news station is about to find this out. And it's going to create many series of chain events, many. Okay, I heard it's going to create many series of chain events, many. So the one person from the news station is um, going to create series of chain events. I guess uh, um, contact the person or people or family that was stole from and see if they can um, do the story on them, I'm presuming. Um, but I heard it's going to go negatively, I guess, for the people that did steal from person, people, place, family, or situation, or negatively for the people that was covering up the situation. So, breach is social media breach in this situation. Wow. Holy crap. Reflection on bottom of the deck.
and someone's butt implant is about to become severely infected and someone's breast implant is about to pop emergency oh my god whoa so you plug it in how it resonates what is going on okay so this instance is the people they're about to have some serious augmentative mishaps with some kind of um sir uh, some kind of plastic surgery of some shape form or fashion now i'm not very familiar with plastic surgery procedures because one i've never worked in that area Re i never worked in reconstructive um or plastic surgery areas um so i'm not familiar with it nor have i ever had any kind of plastic surgery or procedure done on my body so i'm not familiar with the, that area but somebody at least two people in the universe now this could be somebody you're connected to or you however this resonates but somebody's butt implant so some kind of implant they have had in their gluteus maximus of some shape form or fashion i heard is about to get infected um so I'm assuming that will probably be a, a, an emergency too. I didn't hear emergency from the spiritual realm for the channel message, but I'm presuming that's an emergency too because that's an infection. You don't want sepsis because you get sepsis. You could, you know, that that's deadly. Just saying. Um, so some kind of infection with the butt implant. That's serious. And somebody, our breast implant is about to pop. I don't know. I've never had a breast implant. Never had a butt implant. I've never had Botox. I've never had any of that. So you have to plug it in how it resonates. So something in their boob uh, that was implanted. I don't know if it's gel. I don't know if it's um, saline. I don't know. But something they've had planted in those puppies is about to pop. Um, and I heard emergency with that. I didn't hear emergency with that. So this could be somebody. Maybe this is your partner. Maybe this is your spouse maybe this is your family member maybe this is you maybe this is somebody you're connected to maybe it's a co-worker i'm not sure but who you have to plug these people in how it resonates there um this energy here with those messages is emergency emergency energy i feel emergency room energy feel emergency room care energy sanctuary um they need to go to medical attention medical attention with the sanctuary energy there is what I'm presuming. Of course, I'm not a doctor and everybody has free will and they can do what they want. But if it was me and my butt implant got infected, which I don't have any of those kind of cra that crap on my body, period. But if, if it was me, I should say, and I had a butt implant in, implanted in my booty or a breast implant imprinted in my puppy, I would go to the emergency room. It sounds like it hasn't happened, but it's about to. So emergency room energy is what i'm feeling at least god i hope so sanctuary to get medical treatment wow reflection i think these people are about to look back on the choices they've made um or if this is you you're looking back on the choices you made with these some somebody got some um uh, pl plastic surgery um, and I'm serious. Um, maybe they're about to regret the plastic surgery or the choices they have made with um, this. Somebody's stolen here. Somebody's um, plastic surgery is about to backfire. Um, there's a lot going on in here. So you have to plug it in how it resonates. There are messages you have to plug in. Submerged. They're, they're submerged in some kind of... Um, uh plastic surgery mishap here um wow this is holy crap and there's some thieves out in the universe and they're about to be very very publicly humiliated on social media so they're sub they're going to be submerged in embarrassment and regret and um all, um is what i'm presuming and i heard somebody from the news is going to uh, get a hold of that so um yeah and so they're going to want to hide in embarrassment when their um, butt gets exposed on the news. I'm assuming the news person will reach out to you if you're the one that got stole from, I'm assuming. Um, and the thief or thieves, um, this could be jail energy. This could be embarrassment energy. This could be um, regret energy. 
You plug it in how it resonates. Wow, let me see if I hear anything else. Yod. Someone's infant child. is not going to make it. It's going to devastate them. Fighting, going to be fighting for their life. Very, 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 very premature. Very. Oh my God. Wow. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Wow. And I was pulling in some extreme premature, um, it, it, when I pulled this in the other day, they, um, the person had not had the child. So maybe they've had the child. For some, I feel they've already had the child. And for some, they're about to have the child. Um, we, I've been pulling in a pregnant person that's about to give extreme premature birth, basically. Um, so for some, I feel they just had the baby, possibly. And for some, they're about to. However, that resonates in the universe for you or whoever you're connected to. But I heard someone's extreme, um, extremely, extremely, extremely in, uh, premature child is not going to make it. It's not going to make it. And um, it's going to devastate the person. And absolutely, I can, I, I, I can, yeah, I can see that. I would devastate me if that was me. Absolutely. Wow. So sanctuary, they're going to want some private time, some time to themselves, some time to process, some grieving time some um, time to themselves because they just went through a very traumatic loss of a child. Yeah, absolutely. That's terrible. And then they're going to be submerged in um, grief, in loss, in um, this. Wow. I heard extremely, extremely, extremely premature. So what, however that resonates, um, usually premature, you know, like, Normal premature is like 36 weeks. So I don't know. It makes me wonder how premature. Um, I'm guessing here. I didn't hear this from a spiritual realm. I'm guessing like maybe 30 weeks maybe or 34 or maybe less than that. I don't know. But I don't think it's 36 plus. I'll tell you that. It has to be less than 36 weeks is what I'm presuming. Um, extremely, extremely, extremely premature. Preemie is like 36 weeks. So I'm thinking maybe 30 weeks, maybe. Man, that's, oof. oh, this is terrible. I'm so sorry for whoever this is for or if it's somebody um, you're connected to in some shape, form, or fashion. I am so, so, so sorry. This is terrible. And someone's very high up boss is about to travel in soon to your site. It's going to make you very, very, very nervous. And they are there to handle business. Know this. Oh my gosh. Wow. And someone's very high up boss. So I'm thinking executive level. I'm thinking CEO, thinking executive. You could be the CEO or the executive. You have to plug it in how it resonates. We have a lot going in here, on in here, you guys. So you have to plug the messages in how they resonate. They resonate for you. I'm thinking CEO. I'm thinking executive. I'm thinking um, very, very high level. It could be president of the company, um, vice president, um, or corporate or CEO S type level, maybe executive director or something of that age, or very, very, very high level, high, high end. Um, whoever this is for, it's very, very, very high boss. So, but I'm thinking executive. If you are the one flying in, um, you're traveling into this site location if this is you, or if you're either the one traveling into the location executive level type energy ceo uh president vice president etc 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 corporate level energy traveling in to the site whatever site location facility etc 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 this is um i heard you're going to be very very um nervous never very nervous so 
We have two different energies in this situation, the executive corporate level person. So this could be you, if this resonates for you, or you could be the person that works at the site, the site, location, facility, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And you're gonna be scared um, and nervous because you've got such high level energy coming in. I heard they're coming to, and they, they're coming to take care of business. Um, so if you're this energy down here, and this resonates for you, this person is coming to take care of business. And they're not playing around, know this. Oh my God, whoa. And I heard they're not playing around, know this. So you could be this person that works in the site facility or um, location organization, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And then CEO, corporate level, executive director, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. I heard they're not playing around. Confirmation from my intuitive kitty. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. That is confirmation if I've ever heard it. Wow. Come on, baby. I heard they're not meaning business. They're not, I mean, they're meaning business. So I think, because I just got a confirmation from my intuitive kitty. That's my intuitive one. I think maybe this person watches my readings. Because once I heard that spiritual message and I started explaining it, he started meowing. So I think maybe wh whoever you are here, I think you watch my readings possibly. And I'm just being serious. Everything that happens in a reading happens for a reason. I think you might watch my readings. You, um, This person, masculine or femme, whoever you are. And I'm serious about that, possibly. You have to plug it in how it resonates. But I heard you are coming down. You are not playing around. You're about, you're about to, you're not meaning business. I mean, you're meaning business. So you're going to handle some very important business. Maybe you're going to clean house. Maybe you're going to take care of some important things. I think something crazy has been going on in a location, a site, a facility, uh, um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And you are about to handle it. Handle business is exactly what I think. I'm about to handle it in a huge way. Oh, my God. I heard about to handle it in a huge way. Woo, we, yeah, you are not. You're not playing around. And I feel you watch my readings, whoever you are. You're not playing around. And it sounds like it's about to happen soon, whoever you are. Um, so, and I heard this person, you, you two are about to connect in some shape, form, or fashion, I feel. Um, maybe, you, I think you might watch my readings too. So you have to plug yourself in where you fit if you do. But I heard um, you're going to be scared um, and nervous. So maybe you know this person or something has occurred or will occur with this person um, when they get to the site, location, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. If you resonate as this person, possibly, um, you could be this energy. This is not this person's energy. I'll tell you that. This could be this person's energy, scared, nervous energy, and um, submerged, maybe, um, there's going to be extra tasks for you to perform or extra duties for you to perform, or you're going to have to do something you don't want to do. Or maybe in some of these situations, it might be a termination. I didn't hear there was a termination, but your energy will definitely be sanctuary, upright, submerged, upright, because this person is, they're not playing around. They're not friggin' playing around at all. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. Holy crap. Let me see if I hear anything else. The person in the work situation. You're going to reveal information on a hidden camera that you didn't think you were going to reveal but you are to save yourself. Oh my God. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Wow. So if you're this person, I heard you're going to reveal to this person information on a hidden camera um, in someone's home in the past that you didn't think you were going to reveal to this person. Um, but you are going to reveal it to that person to save your ass, I heard. So if you resonate with this energy over here and you feel this might resonate with you, I heard you're going to um, reveal information on a hidden camera um, in a family's home. Okay, information in a, um, 
information on a hidden camera that was in a family's home in the past um, that you didn't think you were going to reveal to this person, but you are going to reveal it to them um, to save your ass, I heard, to save your ass. So I think this person knows about the hidden camera or they just are about to find out about the hidden camera and you know you can't get, uh, get over on this person. That's exactly what I think. Um, that is exactly it. Time to save your ass. Oh my God. Whoa. Oh my God. Okay. I heard that is exactly it. So that is exactly it. So they, they know about the hidden camera or they are about to find out about the hidden camera and they're not going to be happy. Um, I heard time to save your ass. That's a double confirmation in the spiritual messages. Whoever you are, it's time to save your ass and be honest about this hidden camera in a family's home in the past. I think you might have viewed in on this hidden camera in the uh, family's home in the past. And you might, I'm sure you're mortified, you're scared, and you're embarrassed that you did. But the reality is, is that it happened and it's time to release the truth, basically. It's definitely time. Okay, I heard it's definitely time. It's definitely time. So I heard it's definitely time to release the truth. So double confirmation from the spiritual messages. If you are this person, it's definitely time to reveal the truth on the hidden camera in the family's home in the past. It's definitely time. I know you're scared. I know you don't want to, but imagine if somebody did it to you. Would you appreciate that? No, 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 you wouldn't. Um, you would want somebody to reveal information on the hidden camera that, that viewed in through your home. So you have to think of others too, if that helps somebody, okay? You have to be altruistic and think of both sides of the situation. Imagine if you had a hidden camera in your home. Would you want somebody creepily voyeuring through it in your home? No, no, you wouldn't. You'd want somebody to help you and reveal the information. Okay? But this person knows or they are about to find out. And they're not playing around. And you're going to sense this from this person if this resonates for you. Y'all are coming in very, very, very strong. So you plug it in how it resonates. Okay? All right, I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of this. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody have a wonderful day and namaste.